right guys hope you're all well hope you're all having a good monday uh and uh hope you've all had a good start to the week so uh before i start if you're new to the channel uh we're on 170 at the minute uh if you wouldn't mind uh subscribing liking sharing commenting, and all the jazz that goes with it uh, it would be uh much appreciated uh and thank you for joining the channel so i'm going to start on obviously the uh uh leeds leicester and ipswich now, to be fair, who wants it the most is more is more the point. Now, obviously, Ipswich are at the top of the league. Um, Leicester second with a game in hand, uh, and then obviously us uh, in third. Now, if if Ips, uh, sorry, if Leicester can pull off the uh, the uh, the game in hand, where you know if they can get all three points from Southampton, then you know. If they don't drop any more points, I can see them obviously winning the league. But it's more of who is willing to fight for it more. Now, it is very obviously, as we know, it's very, very tight at the top. Um, and now, we've got Southampton coming in the mix with uh, the pretty much six points behind us. Now, if they win their three, uh, if they win their their two games in hand, that puts them level on points with us. So it puts even more pressure on us. But it's more of the point is who is going to grab it by the scruff of the neck and go, you know, we want this title, this title is ours, or we want to get at least an automatic promotion. Um, you know, it do, you don't... it Winning the league would obviously would be ideal for, for the top three, top four teams. Um, but to actually get it by the scruff of the neck, and it, it, especially in these dying moments, you know, it would be ideal for... For actually teams to come out and just go, yes, that's mine. Smash the uh, smash the games out of the park. Take maximum points from uh, from the last three, four or five games left. Um, now, to be fair, looking obviously at the previous games, um, with us losing, uh, Leicester losing, uh, and Ipswich drawing, um, Ipswich are looking like they want it that little bit more than us uh, and. Uh, uh, and Leicester, but with the break that we've had, because obviously we play next Monday, so hopefully that will give us the the kick in the ass that we need. The the rest, the you know, um, the recuperation and obviously the uh, uh, the meetings and everything like that to to discuss tactics and uh, and everything like that that Farco wants. Um, Hopefully we can start pushing uh, and taking it by uh, by the scruff of the neck. And but the only way we're actually going to do that is if uh, Ipswich uh, drop points uh, and uh, and or Leicester drop points. Um, but like I says, we've got now uh, Southampton on our tails um, with the the two games in hand and also obviously six points. Uh, behind us, so they're now pretty much in the uh, in the race for uh, for top two at, uh, at the minute. But guys, uh, this was technically just to find out who you know who I think would actually take the uh, take the league by the scruff of the neck in these last few games uh, of the season. Um, I will still uh, in my previous videos, uh, I will still stand by what I said. Uh, I do believe. That it could be Ipswich, Leeds, and Leicester uh, for the top three. Uh, if I'm wrong, then you know, Christ, I'm wrong. You know, I will hold my hands up, but um, I, I'm still determined that we're actually going to be uh, going to be in the mix of the uh, of the top two, pretty much taking second place. But guys, let me know what you think. Um, who do you who do you guys think will actually um, take the uh, the final few games by the scruff of the neck and try and take the league by the scruff of the neck and uh, want it a hell of a lot more than us um, or just wants it a lot more in general. Uh, but guys, put your comments in the uh, in the comments box below. Uh, also, like I say, if you're new to the channel, thank you very much for, uh, for joining us. Um, it means a lot. We're on 170 subscribers at the minute. Um, you know, it's... Uh, I never thought I would actually get there, to be fair. It's all thanks to... Uh, good friends in uh, obviously um, Stu, Lee, Stacey, Jess, um, Dave, Gary, all, uh, everybody that's uh, been around us from the uh, from the get go. So thank you very much, guys. Um, but yeah, 
Uh, thanks for listening to me waffle on. And like I say, let me know your comments. Uh, who you think will win the league and who do you think will uh, take these last few games by the scruff uh, and push for the league uh, as well. So, guys, thank you very much. I will catch you in my next video. I'm off to go and grab a shower after being at the gym and I'm off to go and chill. So, guys, thank you very much. Bye-bye.